Hi, I'm AJ, and I bought myself a pellet grill to learn how to barbecue. My goal is to go from rookie to barbecue pro. I'll be putting a modern touch on some classic recipes and having a lot of fun on the way. This is Modern Day Q. We are back with another episode, making this Fred's Dish Tri-Tip with these easy ingredients. Let's get started. Let's start with our seasoning. You're gonna do one tablespoon of sea salt. Moving on to the next step, go ahead and grab your pepper and do a tablespoon of pepper. Now, I know it looks like a lot of pepper, but trust me, it comes out great. Do half a tablespoon of that chili lime sauce and then mix it all up. All right, here we are at step two. We're gonna go ahead and season our tri-tip. Now, be generous. Go ahead and put that seasoning everywhere, right? Nothing is worse than a dry tri-tip. So flip that bad boy over and do the same exact thing. Cover the entire tri-tip with all that seasoning, and I promise you, it's gonna come out great. Grab your sea salt, grab your Lowry seasoning, throw it all on the tri-tip once again. Be generous with it because you don't want this thing to come out dry. All right, we're ready for the grill. Throw it on the grill at 225 for about an hour. So while we're waiting for that, quick story time. A couple years ago, I bought my first little condo and I was so excited. But unfortunately, due to some flooding, there has been some mold. So we had to take out this entire kitchen that you see here um, and completely remodel it. You know, there was a lot of termites too, so that didn't help. So what we did is we stripped it down all the way to the studs. It was pretty terrible for a while. We finally were able to install this great kitchen about two years ago. So now I have this beautiful kitchen that I get to make all kinds of food in and film these videos. It's been nothing but a blessing. All right, so store time's over. Turn up the heat and sear tri-tip on both sides for about five to six minutes. Chop it up and serve it to your family. I'll see you on the next episode of Modern Day Q.